You must be tired of these lectures. I know I'm tired of giving them. And now you have to stay here with me all weekend instead of going on the retreat with everyone else? I don't care. Yes, that is the crux of the problem. I don't see why I'm the only one being punished. Because you started the fight. He wouldn't give me back my book. I told you to leave those books in your room. You only have yourself to blame. Doesn't give him the right to just snatch it from me. Does that give you the right to start throwing punches? It wasn't just about the book. What was it then? Nothing. I'll save it for confession. No 
matter what I try, you seem insistent on going down the same sad road as your brother. What a waste. See you. Up and around we go. Whoa! Too slippery. and quiet. Isn't it our job to help boys like him? In the meantime, I'm neglecting the other dozen boys under my care. <sighs> what do you want me to do? You know my opinion. <laughs> I'm not ready to give up on him yet. You can't keep avoiding it. <sighs> Look, I'll talk to him in the morning, okay? <sighs> Good night, Father. Good night, Sister Catherine. Sister. Nathan! You're in big trouble, young man.
Mr. Catherine? Oh, darn. Uh. Uh, Mr. Catherine, I've forgotten my keys. Come Can on. you open the gate for me? Sam, hold up. Gotta learn to watch your back. <laughs> All right. Hey, it's good to see you, little brother. What was that? Really? Again? It's nothing. You told me you'd stay out of trouble, though. He was talking shit about us. So? He said that Dad dumped us here because we're worthless, and Mom is in hell because... Nathan, Nathan, come on. They're just saying it because it gets to you. All right? You just gotta learn to laugh it off. You wouldn't. Well, do as I say, not as I do. Here. You'll catch a cold. So, what are you doing here like this anyway? If the nuns catch you, they're gonna call the cops. Well, I got something for you. And I couldn't wait till Christmas. What? It's outside. What happened to us staying out of trouble? Uh, this is an exception. Mm-hmm. <laughs> Now he's dumb. Come on. Yeah, give me a... <laughs> Shoot, <laughs> you might. This is just feeding you enough. <laughs> that place is kind of empty. Where is everyone? Some Bible retreat. Yeesh. I remember those. <laughs> How's Father Duffy doing? He's the one decent guy in there. You should come and say hi. Nah, I don't need the guilt. This way. Uh, we're getting there. That was easy. You didn't prop it. I, I, I did. At least I thought I did. No, it doesn't matter. We're gonna take the high road. The high road? Just follow me. Watch this. Whoa. And now, we take the high road. Have you done this before? Uh, once or twice. Here, come on. Your turn. <sighs> so, what you been up to? Uh, working mostly. Are you still dating that girl? Oh, uh, Crystal? On again, off again. Currently, off. Okay. No guts. No glory. Whoa, whoa. Just don't think about it. You got this. Big deal. Yeah. 
Nothing to it. Stay with me. Pretty cool, huh? Yeah, totally. Hey, through here. Right behind you. There's a jump coming up. Okay. and easy. Ah! Oops. Was that a sin? I think that's a sin. Are you ready, Tarzan? Yeah. All right, go ahead. Oh. Up the steeple. Come on. I can't jump that high. All right, just go around the corner. <sighs> it's a nice view, huh? Yeah. <laughs> Not bad. You ever been up here before? This particular roof? No. You do know where you're going, right? Eh, more or less. You wait here, and you watch me. Thank you. How about you take this one? Really? Yeah, really. I'll follow your lead. Attaboy, Nathan. Okay. Whoa! Oh. 
Okay. All right. After you. Now, head down. Just like that, we're out. All right. Check it out. Huh? Whoa, <laughs> you got the 250? 250? What are you talking about? No, this is the 500 CC twin. No way. Yeah. Where'd you lift it from? Whoa. That's a low blow. But hey, I'll have you know that I am a changed man. Bought this with hard earned cash. Here, come on, take a seat. What? The only time you pull a stunt like this is when you're trying to make up for something. You are too smart for your own good, you know that? All right. I got this job. Pays well. Really well. But, uh, I gotta leave town for a little bit. What's a little bit? Uh, like, uh, a year. At the most, and then I'll be back before you even know it, all right? You're bailing on me. Come on, don't be so dramatic. What, so it wasn't bad enough to leave me in that place? Why would you do this to me, Sam? Wait, wait, I'm doing this for you. The money I make is for the both of us. And then in a couple of years, a when you're out... years? Take me with you. I, I can barely support myself. I'll pitch in. I know you think the orphanage sucks. You have no idea. Yeah, but it's the best thing for you right now. All right? You just gotta trust me on that one. It's not fair. Hey, yeah. nothing about our lives has been fair. But we've made it work, right? Sure. Well, you know, the bike wasn't the only surprise. And I guess I'm gonna have to ruin the next one. What? I found Mom's stuff. Everything that Dad sold, I tracked down the buyer. If you're saying this just to make me feel better... Mm -hmm. I swear to God. Where? Yeah. On the other side of town. What do you say we go and get it back? You mean steal it? Yeah, it's not stealing if it was ours to begin with. I'm pretty sure the cops aren't going to see it that way. Well, then let's not get caught. You ready for this? Hell yeah. <laughs> 